If you're looking for something brand new, this is the week to do it as both Adidas and Nike are dropping brand new silhouettes. Let's start the show. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade, and this week actually kicks off with a bunch of shoes dropping on Thursday. First up, we have the Nike Epic React Fly Knit dropping for both men and women in a few different colorways. I've been running pretty consistently in this shoe, and if you want something for those three to 10 mile runs, I think this one definitely works. It also looks good as a lifestyle shoe. You can grab those for $150 over at Finish Line. Speaking of lifestyle shoes, Nike also has the Air Vapor Max Fly Knit Utility dropping in a black colorway. I have yet to actually pick up a pair of these, but I do recall seeing quite a few on them when I was on vacation a few weeks ago. You can grab those for $225. Keeping with the lifestyle trend, the Adidas d Rupt is releasing in a few colorways on Thursday as well. This is definitely a unique looking shoe and the price point is really nice at $100. If premium is more your style, then the Desert Camel pair of the Air Max 1 will release on Thursday as well. Those will cost you $130. It's summertime, which usually brings out the brighter kicks, and Nike has the Air Vapor Max 2 in what they're calling the Pure Air colorway. As you can see, it has this bright green or neon green exterior, and those will cost you $190. Jumping ahead to Friday, we have the first of the brand new silhouettes that'll be dropping this week. It's the Nike EXP X14. A shoe that Nike has labeled as basically an experiment that made it to production. The model comes from the sportswear side of things and features some of the style we've seen on the Nike Zoom Vaporfly 4% from the Breaking 2 campaign. Personally, I'm a fan of runners that are converted into lifestyle shoes and the fact that this one features Nike React only make it better in my book. Look for those that cost you $120 in a few different colorways. Speaking of runners that have made the move to the lifestyle silhouette, Finish Line has a New Balance 990 V4 dropping in two different colorways. Definitely a classic look and those will cost you $170. The folks at the Three Stripes continue to push new looks for Boost and the latest is the Adidas Pure Boost Gold Limited and it's going to be in the core black colorway. As you can see, if you like to rock all black kicks, this one should fit your wardrobe perfectly. Those will cost you 140. Switching over to Nike, we have the Air Force One in triple white with that Velcro swoosh. Now, these are a women's only release, but if your foot is small enough, I don't see why you shouldn't squeeze into a pair. Those will cost you $120. One of the last drops scheduled for Friday is the Adidas Originals F22 Prime Knit. This shoe released a little while ago in a few different colors that made the model pop a little more, but if you want something that's a little sleeker, this black color should fit you perfectly. Those will cost you 140. Jumping ahead, we have a new release from Adidas on the Alpha Bounce Instinct. This is an upgraded version of the Alpha Bounce silhouette, which has gotten a little love over the last few months. Uh, these are dropping in a ton of different colorways and I really like the way they put this look together. Pick those up for 120 bucks and keep it on the Alpha Bounce train, Adidas also has the Alpha Bounce Instinct Climb Up. This is a slightly modified version of the shoe and it features two colors that are dropping for that same 120. For the final two shoes, we have one more from Adidas and that is the Yeezy 500 in Utility Black. Now that I say that, there are quite a few actually black sneakers dropping this weekend and the Yeezy 500 is probably the most hyped of them all. As with past pairs of this shoe, you can expect to pay $200 if you can actually secure yourself a pair. Oddly enough, George Brand, well, they're keeping it pretty quiet this weekend. The only release we have for them is the Air Jordan 1 High OG. This one features that royal blue upper that definitely pops and mixes things up with that white swoosh and a white Jordan wings patch, or logo, I should say. Uh, you can expect those to cost you the usual 160 over at Finish Line on Saturday. All right, so that's gonna do it for the show today. As usual, I only wanted to include things that I thought you guys would definitely be hyped for. Hope you have a wonderful holiday. If you wanna find out about any more of the shoes that I talked about in the video today, make sure you check the links down below. I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line, and as always, I appreciate you. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.